This is kind of an uh, eclectic video that we have here for you today. Lots of different subjects going on. Number one, we have the dog coming. So we have the St. Bernard that's gonna come live with us on the bus. My daughter's coming down to get ready to go for the wedding that we're heading to Florida for, uh, for her wedding. Um, we did some work on the property. Uh, we had an incident with some bats or some really cool footage of some bats on here. We had some buses come. We got a tour of a real cool Prevo bus. Uh, we got our silver uh, play button award from YouTube. Uh, that's all in this video. Uh, this video is sponsored by Skillshare. That's an online learning platform for creatives. Uh, we've been taking some cool classes on there. There's business classes, uh, all kinds of photography stuff. Kelly and I have been taking a class with Michael. Uh, uh, ASL class, so we've been learning sign language, uh, able lingo. Um, it, it's been fun for us to do that. It's something we've always wanted to do, so learning sign language is something that we now have the opportunity to do through that, and uh, it's a really neat environment. So we do have a special bonus uh, for the first thousand people that click the link below. You can get a uh, free trial membership of the uh, Skillshare Premium Membership. Uh, so if you want to click through and check that out, uh, it doesn't cost you anything. Uh, and there's lots of cool classes you can go check out. Like I said, art and other creative type stuff, um, graphic design, different things like that. So it's a real cool platform. It's easy to learn on and uh, go check it out. Otherwise, watch our video. Thank you. Skillshare has this great website. It's super easy to navigate and find the classes that you're looking for. Again, they have art and photography and all kinds of things for you to look through and find the class that you're looking for. And it's under $10 a month. So it's a great opportunity. So please go check it out. Lenny's all ready for the trip. We're going to be leaving here soon. Uh, first thing in the morning. So my daughter's going to be here with her fiance and the dog. So the dog's coming to live with us. Uh, Leroy is St. Bernard. If you remember, our daughter had up until the wedding to live at our home and then we're selling it. So she is moving out and she has three St. Bernards that have lived in the house there with us. And getting a new place to live with three dogs is gonna be very, very hard. So we're gonna take the one dog, Leroy, who's gonna come and live with us, hopefully, if it goes well. He's been on the bus before and we're, we've had you know five St. Bernards, so we're very familiar with everything that St. Bernards do. Uh, he has one eye, he's a little bit disabled, but he's, he's a really good mannered dog, uh, super lovable, friendly. So he's gonna be with us. He's gonna go down to Florida for the wedding and as long as everything goes well with the trip, uh, he'll be staying with us here on the property and we're getting things ready for him here. And uh, we'll get some hopefully grass out here soon too, but uh, it's gonna be, Quite the adventure with the dog out here. I hooked up a 60 foot runner here uh, for the dog for now until we get the invisible fence set up here. So at least have an area here where he can walk around. I'm, I'm a little nervous. He's used to a fenced yard, so I'm not sure what he's gonna do out here. So, but, uh, He's been trained for an in-ground fence before, an invisible fence, so I don't think it'll be too hard to get him used to that out here, and then we can get him a couple acres where he can roam out here pretty good. I'm replacing the fuel filter that goes to my transfer pump. So you can see how it's got a bunch of slimy nastiness in it there. Um, I change these about once every three three tanks. I, I need to get a, this is just a little inline for a transfer pump that transfers from one tank to the other. Um, but that's pretty nasty in there. So I've always had that problem with that tank, but I keep these new ones on hand, real easy to change. It doesn't affect me. Um, as long as I change it off. If I would have left this on for another few times, it might've eventually got plugged up. A bat just climbed out of the hole on that tree. And he's Let me go. <laughs> getting ready to start a fire and he was in that little that little hole right there. He just climbed out and he went down somewhere right there. I didn't see him hit the ground, but he certainly didn't fly away. Sorry, we burned your home, Mr. Bat. I don't know where he went to. I saw him fall out of there. He like kind of crawled out with his wings. Get away from the fire, Mr. Bat. Hope you're not hurt. He 
just crawled to there to get away from the fire. Well, he might be hurt. Sorry, Mr. Bat. There's a lot of dead wood on there and there's a lot of trees that we cut down six months ago. And then there's a bunch of saplings. So hopefully it'll get hot enough for the cooks off those saplings. Two bats. Run, Mr. Bat, run. And the other one's over here. He's almost flying. Does he have, do they have to be on a tree to fly? Is that why? They have to drop down from something? Well, let me get him on a shovel and put him up to a tree. That one flew away. So there's hope for this other one. Come on, dude. Can make the yeah, he's going to climb the tree and then he can fly, I think. Oh, Kelly would be so happy if she didn't kill a bat. They are our friends. He's definitely afraid. Come on, climb the tree and fly away. I know you can do it. That's what you need. Bats need to drop. He certainly doesn't look hurt. There he goes. Goodbye. Get some mosquitoes. Sorry, we burned your home. Later that night, both bats came back and I shot some real cool slow motion video of them flying overhead. It's a major award. <laughs> you ready? I'm ready. Are you sure? Huh? It's on thick paper, not <laughs> whoopy. It's not just the actual button part. So it's a mirror. That's interesting. I've not seen that style before. Scott's not allowed to touch it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a mirror in the thing with the. Yep. yep. I got my big stupid scratch on my forehead. <laughs> Bashing myself with a wrench. Neato. Cool. 
So is there any signal loss between that fiber there, that little connector, or no? Or just negligible? The only thing that's going to cause signal loss would be uh, water, if water got in there, or if something was cut or bent really bad or something like that. Fiber's pretty cool just because, you know, coax and stuff, there's a lot of, it's RF, so other signal can affect it, but with us, it pretty much either works or it doesn't, so. So we'll have 300 up and down. Yes, sir. I will run a speed test when I get done and show you. <laughs> I can see it or not. It's gonna turn, oh, there it goes. Wow, that's impressive. Yeah, <laughs> zero ping is pretty nice. <laughs> Dave and Pam came and stayed for the night last night. It's nice to be able to visit again. They had a breakdown on the way here. That uh, engine lost a uh, fuel line that goes from the injector pump to the injector. It just dumped fuel all over the hot exhaust. And luckily it was uh, under warranty, so they got it repaired. But uh, that delayed them a couple days in getting here. If you remember last year or in the spring they came by and brought us a chainsaw to borrow and a lawnmower. I'm gonna hook up the toad at the bottom of the hill. It's really beautiful out here this morning. A little chilly, but rising up off of the hillside here. With the truck all hooked up, that was quite the process. Wow, this is pretty. It's a 1989? Yep. 1989. And it has a 8V92? Yep. Uh, TA, I assume? Uh, V92 turbo. Turbo, yeah. No. Uh, no Feels wide. Oh. It's really nice. I took the table up to in there so the dogs can sleep on it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Yeah, big bathroom. Yeah, big shower back there. Yeah, that is a Not big bad. shower and big bedroom. Clean? It's a nice, nice bus. How long have you had this one? Uh, seven years, six years. It was all carpet, right? I put the floor in. Oh, it's much better with the. Yeah. I I prefer the the wood floor than over carpeting in a bus any day. It's got a big Cummings uh, diesel generator. It's a country coach conversion. Is that right? Yeah. 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 I got this on my computer. This is all you have to see here. This is your other bus. But, uh, what happened? It needs a new new engine? Is that uh, I overheated a little bit, but I shut it down. 
and I had to tow it home because it ran out of water and it turned rrr, 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 but you know it got a little warm yeah that happens That's okay. On the, on the highway, it goes up to 55. That's good. That's good. Yep. 40 way, right? Yep. Go potty, buddy. He hasn't yet. Okay, come on. Hey, Bailey. Hi, Dad. We'll go over here. There's a, good, there's a good spot for you. You're gonna see. Come on. Hey, Jonathan. Hello. <laughs> come on. Wow, he's freaking out. Okay, we have all of this over here for you. Uh, why don't you get those lights plugged in here? So we have more light out here. Oh, well. We just moved everything. The tent used to be up against the back of the bus. Here, here. Yes, it's pretty. I'll pull up first, maybe I'll call you. Um, turn the light on right here. When you get up that stairs, turn around. Right up here. Oh, he's coming up. There's a, there's a light here. Oh, come on. Just go, 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 go. He's going. That's a good boy. That's good. Oh, the hat's over it. Good boy. Nope. Hey, Leroy. You thought you're stickly, Roy?
we were able a little bit to, we went ahead and let Leroy walk around the property. We just laid the leash down and let him kind of walk around. He didn't run off or anything. He stayed by us. Uh, he's pretty good. So uh, my concern about, you know, him not knowing what he was going to do uh, on the property. So we'll, I think we'll slowly get him into not, you know, having some time off leash on the property, uh, but just want to get him used to it first before we do that. But uh, we'll see how it goes on the bus trip.